Hello, hello everybody. Welcome to the channel if you are new and welcome back if you're already a subscriber. Today I am very excited to be opening my Hobonichi Techo 2023 order. Now, I did post the jet pins order first because I wanted everyone to know that I am using the Kokuyo Jaboon Techo Biz Edition for 2023. This is merely accessories and fun stuff that I could not turn down because um, I am just a Disney girl through and through and I couldn't resist getting some of the really adorable products from Hobonichi this year um, featuring one of my favorite characters. So we're gonna dive in, but I just want another disclaimer to say that if you really wanna see what my planner for this year is gonna be, make sure you go check that video out. I will try to remind myself to link it in the editing process. Um, also, I will have a separate video on how I actually set up my planner and we'll go over systems and all that and other, other videos. This is not that video. This is just me unboxing my amazing order from Hobonichi. That is just what we are here for today. Again, if you want to see that jet pins um, order, I'll try to have it linked as well, just to help everybody out. And I'm also trying really hard not to cut my whole fingers off. Oh, I'm so excited. This actually shipped really fast and really seamless. They switched carriers this year. A lot of times they use um, UPS. So it's been kind of complicated in the past. This is like the fastest, easiest order I've ever gotten. It's okay if it were a liar or a joke. Try and say I had something good today too and the closure I have something is good. As good as a tiny stone. It's rolling here and there more often than you think. Okay. I keep all my boxes, so I love reading all the quotes. Ready? Ah, ah. Okay, so <laughs> I have a super huge love for Marie from Aristocats. And I waffled a lot. We're going to just take everything out. I waffled a lot on what I was going to do um, for the sale, if I was going to participate or not. And I ultimately decided um, to pull some money from my Disney budget, my, spend, my Disney spending budget, to purchase items that I knew there was no way, shape, or form that I was going to find anything like this in Orlando or Disney. They just don't have product like that. It's just not maybe at the one in Tokyo because obviously Japan is very stationary obsessed as well um but definitely not in Florida so I decided that it was well worth the redistribution of funds and it still let me stay on budget so I was really proud of that but I am so happy and I am so excited to go through this with you and just kind of sneak peek show you um some more parts and pieces for 2023 planning. So I guess we'll just open it up. Oh my God. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay. So normally I would make myself pick and I did not. I got both pouches because I am a complete lunatic and am fine with that. Plus I am a huge stickler for something that I can reuse. Um, so I was fine with it. I'm really I feel like I'm going to be really scared to use them. So I might have my mom like put protectant spray on them. I don't know. I'm slightly terrified to even take them out of the packaging. So we're just going to do it. We're going to do it all ASMR style for everyone. Ah, I'm so excited. So if you look really close or even not close at all, there are all these cute little Marie's all over You've got that classic pink little ribbon. We're just gonna toss all the filling everywhere. I should probably toss it in the box behind me. So it looks like we've got like a little side pouch. I've got this little, I might have to put that off to the side so I can put it in my planner. We've got silica gel that we don't need. So there's like a little pouch over here pouch here it looks like 
it's like the perfect size to fit in here. And actually I may end up using this as a pouch while I'm at Disney. Oh, I'm so excited to go through this. This is precious, absolutely precious. Okay, so now we're gonna go through this one. So this is the other pouch. So there was the horizontal and the vertical. This is, I think this is actually gonna be really fun for um, my, um, what journal? The sequence journal that I'm getting. I think that's gonna be a really cute little pouch for that. So I'm excited now for that to come in. Um, it is in transit from Singapore. So we'll see, at least at the time I'm shooting. So this is the other pouch. It is, it has a pocket too and is upright from here. I want to see what can fit in here. Like, okay, so I could get a pair of scissors in there. I'm going to try to put my paint pen or my glue pen in here. So it's not really all that tall. There's just a pen. So this is not ideal for a pencil pouch. Let me see. Pencil. I'm gonna put it in upside down. For, yeah, so it is gonna be kind of tricky. This is gonna be good for maybe like accessories or something. I don't really know what I'm gonna put in here yet. I think I was just like in a Marie purchase obsessive haze. So we've got both the pouches. Super stinking cute. I'm gonna set those off to the side. Clean up a minute. Put away all these random things. <laughs> or at least get them off the screen. Okay, so we'll put, we'll go through this. We'll just save the cover for absolute last. So these are the A6 folders. So I actually thought these would be super great for the little journal, which is this one. Um, and I thought it would also be really great because I can tuck these in and these would be really good for different things. Like I could use them for cash. I actually have a little machine. I have my um, fuse tool so I could close it off and let it be like a whole closed pocket. But I do love all the little... Um, the little kind of like clips from the movie or just the cuteness level is too much. Now do you do? This is my favorite, me first. I'm not spoiled, I'm pampered. And then it's got them being like prissy kitties on the back. Oh my gosh, so cute, so cute. And like I said, that'll fit in this little guy. These are a Six size journals and cards. I didn't opt for the A5, which is what size planner I have because it actually docked a folder and it docked this one. Like it took out the me first and that was the one I wanted the most. So I thought it would actually be kind of nice to have like smaller folders that I could put in other things that weren't so big. So this is the journal which I don't know how many pages are in here, but I'm really happy about it actually. And then it has like this cute little doodle, it's blank paper and then it has just like the cute little doodle of Marie with the little mice, which is really stinking cute. Oh. How cute, and I just wanna use it like as little like notepad paper. Again, this would be a really great thing to like chuck in here. I could probably do wow. this little folder or that little binder. And if it weren't like, I could probably put these folders in here full of like some stickers and things and just make it easy. I could also use this as the like a pencil pouch. So I am definitely glad I got the big one because I do like 
pouches and I have far too many of them, but I do hang on to pouches for a very long time before I switch them out. Um, so there's that. Now this is what I'm the most excited about. <gasps> oh my gosh. Okay. So this is my first cover that I've ever gotten from Hobonichi. I have always just kind of had them naked as is. Again, I really am just, I love Marie. She is absolutely hands down, like one of my fave characters. Um, I need to look cause I know I have the little, um, oh, I forgot that they have the little charms on them. Oh my God, I've forgotten, how cute. So this is actually raised, it's not just printed in there. So that'll probably rub off in time, unfortunately. Life book. Okay, just kind of is like care and keeping. Okay, so we're gonna keep that. Another one of these little guys. Okay, so the front cover, it's all fabric. It almost feels like a beach bag material a little bit. And then you've got these like embroidered stars and then the whole Marie is embroidered in along with the bonjour and the bonjour kind of feels, nope, it's embroidered in there too. And then we've got two pin loops which I'm really excited about because I could probably put, like throw my everyday black pen in one and then like maybe a highlighter or something in the other. I love all these little pouches here, whether I put like my cards or little doodads, then there's this whole pocket. And then this is for your, like your planner to slip back in, but you could totally put other things. This is, I think, where you put your page keeper. I, get, I have to get up in my closet and dig out my old one because I have one, but I didn't realize that you like need a cover kind of for it. And then the other half of your planner tucks back here. And then on the back, you have this great little pouch, but in there, there's the cats looking up at you, which is so cute. And then the trust me today, a good day is about to begin. Oh, I can't handle it. It's so cute. Okay, then we've got these little charms. So we have the M for Marie and they're all on like this pretty purple ribbon and we've got like a little milk container. So this is, I'm going to go ahead and put, maybe I won't. This guy, actually, let's just do this maybe. and see how this goes because again this is my first cover so we're just going to be real and authentic and do this together so I being that this is my first cover and it is very 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 nice um and I would like to take good care of it and have it for future planners I bought a cover on cover which is not an expensive item at all it's not that bad um so that I could protect this, at least try to. So it looks like it's pretty self-explanatory and easy, but we're also going to see how <laughs> self-explanatory and easy it actually is. Oh, this does look pretty easy. Okay. And it looks like it's not like covering anything up that's important. Like it doesn't come too far over. Like I could still put a card in here and it would be fine. I could still put something in this pocket and it would be fine. I think the same is gonna apply on this side. I feel like I'm manhandling it a little bit, but that's okay with me. Same applies. And then now this beautiful, lovely thing is going to be protected. Again, I'm super scared about these little jokers and I may have to like keep them tucked back here or something. <laughs> I don't know how I'm gonna fare with that, but I just wanted to show you how easy that that is and how worth it, it 
It is, oh, look at these. Oh my gosh. These are the smartest people on the freaking planet. So this is like, this is genius. Okay, so this is like, um, like a Ziploc bag type of thing going on back here, I think, from what I can tell, where it will latch, but then you can still pop it open and get to your little pocket back here. That's fantastic. Okay, sold. Yeah, these are not that expensive. I want to say on like jet pens, they might be eight bucks. So if you didn't order them in your Hobonichi haul, they are super easy to pick up and clearly worth it. I mean, you pay all that money for the really pretty cover. You might as well protect it. That's a great investment um, that I definitely don't regret. I look forward to building this lovely guy out and showing you how all of these lovely things are gonna come together and be the base for my 2023 planner. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. I hope you're enjoying watching all of the um, 2023 supplies arrive. I'm excited to be sharing all the little hauls and goodies with you guys lately too. Thank you so much until the next video. I hope you have fun creating your own little wonderlands.